This image was shot with the Canon EOS R using a 24 to 105 millimeter lens and an Elenchrom Ranger Quadra lighting system and Roscoe gels. <laughs> wow, well, that was not interesting. Let's think about this now. I want to describe an image that I just put up like this one and what information does my actual camera gear give the viewer? I mean, personally, I'm not sure what it gives the viewer because I also shot this with the exact same gear and I shot this with the exact same gear. So I really don't feel like the gear is telling any kind of story to either a photographer that wants to learn or a viewer of the art. So I just wanted to talk a little bit about when we caption our images and how to make it more relevant. So I think the first thing, think about your subject and think about your audience. So for example, with my starter image, if I was going to post this to a photography site, I would say something like, I shot this using Roscoe gels. I had a DIY black V-flat behind the model. The V-flat was lined with plastic sheeting. I fired two red gels at the plastic sheeting. And then in the foreground, I had a crossbar with two light stands with another sheet of plastic, which the model ripped through. The model's key light was gelled with a pale green. And from below with some barn doors, I had a bright blue. Now that gives another photographer an idea of how I actually got here. So I wanna show you something. Look at this image, look at this image. One was shot by a Sony and one was shot by a Canon. Can you tell which? I certainly can't except that I know my editing style and Phil's editing style and Phil and I did a shoot together and Basically, we used the same lights, the same everything, except he used his camera and I used my camera. Okay, so let's say I am now releasing this image onto my Instagram. And here, my followers are not so much photographers. These are people that want to see my art. I, they don't really give a shit about gels, what kind of plastic, where I put things. They don't care. So I'm going to say something like, no excuses. This woman is going for what she wants and there's no barrier in her way. She's breaking through it. I'm going to say something like that. I'm going to recognize the subject and the feeling of the image. That's what I'm going to do because I want to bring my viewer into the image. Photography is about the subject and it's about, it's about either educating someone on how to take the image or it's about the actual subject and it's not about the gear. I think that if you want to get more engagement from your followers, you want to A, know your audience and B, speak to that audience. So if you're trying to teach people about photography, then sure, you can throw your gear in there, but give something actually useful so that they can understand how this image was created. And if you're trying to get people to hire you for shoots, they don't care about what kind of gear you have. You're gonna wanna get them in the emotional zone you're going to want to say a story. You're going to want to put the emphasis on your subject and on the results, not on the gear. So that's a wrap. If you have anything you want to comment on, drop them in the comments. I'll reply. And don't forget to like, subscribe, all that crap. I'll see you in two weeks. Bye-bye.